In this episode, we are visiting this old elementary school, which was still full of old remnants from the past. Join us and find out about the history of this old school. When entering this site, we first had to go over the still active terrain of the new school. Luckily, due to the holidays, this wasn't that big of a problem. Not a lot of time later, we were inside the school. <laughs> Here we immediately came across old artifacts from the past. What was also very noticeable was the peeling paint nearly everywhere. For example this corridor, which was in a heavy state of decay due to the many holes in the roof. This created a stunning scenery. But okay, let's go further to the classrooms. We really didn't expect it to be fine in a fully furnished classroom. With its multiple desks and the now vintage toys laying everywhere, this truly was something unique. What we also found it were old pictures of probably the last children that went to this school. It's quite weird seeing all this personal stuff thrown around throughout the building. Why this happened is unknown to us. But well, let's take a look at the history of this place. This school was built around the 1900s as a monastery, but shortly after its opening, it got converted into a primary school. After this, the information we could found online stopped, so we unfortunately don't have an exact date of closure. But looking at the toys, this building was probably closed during the 90s. But let's continue our exploring in this school. After we explored these two classrooms, we decided to head up to the upper floor. The way up seemed to be quite sketchy though. Upstairs it was mostly just storage for old equipment. But also an unexpected bed top. After we explored the upper floor we decided to conclude our explore. The current future for this historic school is still unknown to this day. But looking at the state of the building it will probably be demolished in the near future. <laughs> 